Hi, this is Rob. How to put the Casio FX CG50 in exam mode for IB exam, UK exam, NL Netherlands exam, and a US exam. If you're having trouble following the steps in this video, you need to check which operating system OS your Casio FX CG50 is using. I am currently using version 03.60.0202. How do I check which version my Casio FX CG50 is using? To check your version, scroll to the system mode, press the EXE button, go to version by pressing the F4 button, and there is my OS version, 03.60.0202. To exit out of here, press the exit button, then press the menu button. How do I go into exam mode for the IB International Bachelorate exam on the Casio FX CG50? First, you need to turn off the calculator by pressing the shift button, then the AC on button. Then, with your left hand, press and hold the 7 button and the cosine button at the same time. While holding those two buttons, Long press the blue AC on button. Then this screen will appear. Enter examination mode for IB. For yes, press the F1 button. For no, press the F6 button. If you press F6, it will take you out of the exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into the exam mode. I will press F1 to go into IB exam mode. Then this screen pops up. How to exit exam mode is explained in the link app. Continue, F2. Stop, F6. You will press F2 to go into exam mode. Press the F6 button to not go into exam mode. If you press F6, it will take you out of exam mode and back into the main menu or the last screen you had before going into exam mode. I will press the F2 button to continue going into the exam mode. Then this screen pops up, entering exam mode. The calculator will take a few seconds, then the screen will go black. Then back on. Then you are in exam mode for the IB exam. You will see this flashing R in the upper right of the screen. That flashing R will slow down after about 15 minutes in the exam mode. And you will also see this green border on the sides and the bottom of the screen. If you do not see a R and a green border, then you are not in IB exam mode. You may be in another exam mode if you see a different letter in a different color. When in IB exam mode, the auto power off will automatically be set to 60 minutes, which means if you did not touch a button in the last 60 minutes, the calculator will automatically power off. To see the elapsed time since you have been in exam mode, press the red alpha button, then the negative sign button. Then the screen will appear briefly, about three seconds, showing the elapsed time. You can restart the elapsed time by pressing the restart button on the back of the calculator or by re-entering IB exam mode. While in IB exam mode, if you tried to enter one of the calculator modes that are restricted for the exam, you will get this pop-up message. Examination mode. Press exit. Press the exit button to make this message disappear. To see how to exit exam mode, go towards the end of this video. How do I go into exam mode for the UK exam on the Casio FX CG50? First, you need to turn off the calculator by pressing the shift button, then the blue AC on button. Then, with your left hand, press and hold the one button, and the comma button at the same time. While holding those two buttons, long press the blue AC on button. Then this screen will appear. Enter examination mode for UK. For yes, press the F1 button. For no, press the F6 button. If you press F6, it will take you out of the exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into the exam mode. I will press F1 button to go into UK exam mode. 
When you press the F1 button, this screen appears. How to exit exam mode is explained in the Link app. Continue. Press F2 button. You will press F2 to go into exam mode. Stop. Press the F6 button to not go into the exam mode. If you press the F6, it will take you out of exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into exam mode. I will press the F2 button to go into UK exam mode. Then you get this message in red. This examination mode is not allowed for IB, that is the International Bachelorate Exam. It gives you this message because different exams allow you access to different things on this calculator. Yes, F1 means to press the F1 button if you want to continue to go into exam mode for UK exam. If you press the F6, it will take you out of exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into exam mode. I will press F1 to go into UK exam mode. The screen pops up, says entering exam mode. The calculator will take a few seconds, then the screen will go black, then back on. When you are in exam mode for the UK exam, you will see this flashing R in the upper right of the screen. That flashing R will slow down after 15 minutes in exam mode. And you will also see this magenta colored border on the sides and the bottom of the screen. If you do not see a R and a magenta border, then you are not in UK exam mode. If you see a different color for the border, you may be in a different exam mode. When in UK exam mode, the auto power off will automatically be set to 60 minutes, which means if you did not touch a button in the last 60 minutes, the calculator will automatically power off. To see the elapsed time since you have been in exam mode, press the red alpha button, then the negative sign button. Then this screen will appear briefly, about three seconds, showing the elapsed time. You can restart the elapsed time by pressing the restart button on the back of the calculator or by re-entering the UK exam mode. While in UK exam mode, if you try to enter one of the calculator modes that are restricted for the exam, you will get this pop-up message. Examination mode. Press exit. Press the exit button to make this message disappear. To see how to exit exam mode, go towards the end of this video. How do I go into exam mode for the NL Netherlands exam on the Casio FX CG50? First, you need to turn off the calculator by pressing the shift button, then the blue AC on button. Then with your left hand, press and hold the 8 button and this arrow button at the same time. While holding those two buttons, long press the blue AC on button. Then this screen will appear. Enter examination mode for NL. For yes, press the F1 button. For no, press the F6 button. If you press F6, it will take you out of the exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into exam mode. I will press the F1 button to go into NL exam mode. When you press the F1 button, this screen appears. How to exit exam mode is explained in the link app. Continue. Press F2 button. You will press F2 to go into exam mode. Stop. Press the F6 button to not go into exam mode. If you press F6, it will take you out of exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into the exam mode. I will press F2 to continue into the NL exam mode. Then you get this message in red. This examination mode is not allowed for IB. That is the International Bachelor Exam. It gives you this message because different exams allow you access to different things on this calculator. Yes, F1 means to press the F1 button if you want to continue to go into the exam mode for NL exam. If you press F6, it will take you out of the exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into exam mode. I will press F1 to go into NL exam mode. The screen pops up, says enter in exam mode. The calculator will take a few seconds, then the screen will go black, then back on. When you are in exam mode for the NL exam, you will see this flashing N in the upper right of the screen. That flashing N 
will slow down after 15 minutes in exam mode. And you will also see this yellow color border on the sides and the bottom of the screen. If you do not see a N and a yellow border, then you are not in NL exam mode. If you see a different color for the border, you may be in a different exam mode. When in NL exam mode, the auto power off will automatically be set to 60 minutes, which means if you did not touch a button in the last 60 minutes, the calculator will automatically power off. To see the elapsed time since you have been in exam mode, press the red alpha button, then the negative sign button. Then this screen will appear briefly about three seconds, showing the elapsed time. You can restart the elapsed time by pressing the restart button on the back of the calculator or by re-entering NL exam mode. While in NL exam mode, if you try to enter one of the calculator modes that are restricted for the exam, you will get this pop-up message. Examination mode, press exit. Press the exit button to make this message disappear. To see how to exit exam mode, go towards the end of this video. How do I go into exam mode for the Texas US exam on the Casio FX CG50? First, you need to turn off the calculator by pressing the shift button, then the blue AC on button. Then with your left hand, press and hold the plus sign button and the divided by sign button at the same time. While holding these two buttons, long press the blue AC on button. Then this screen will appear. Enter examination mode for Texas US. For yes, press the F1 button. For no, press the F6 button. If you press F6, it will take you out of the exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into exam mode. To continue going into exam mode, press the F1 button. I will press the F1 button. When you press the F1 button, this screen appears. How to exit exam mode is explained in the link app. Continue, press F2 button. Press F2 to go into exam mode. Stop, press the F6 button to not go into exam mode. If you press F6, it will take you out of exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into the exam mode. I will press the F2 button to continue going into Texas US exam mode. Then you get this message in red. This examination mode is not allowed for IB, that is the International Bachelorette Exam. It gives you this message because different exams allow you access to different things on this calculator. Yes, F1 means to press the F button if you want to continue to go into exam mode for Texas US exam. If you press F6, it will take you out of exam mode and back to the main menu or the last screen you had before going into exam mode. I will press the F1 button to go into exam mode. You will see this message, entering exam mode. The calculator will take a few seconds, then the screen will go black then back on. When you are in exam mode for the Texas US exam, you will see this flashing T in the upper right of the screen. That flashing T will slow down after about 15 minutes in exam mode. And you will also see this cyan color border on the sides and the bottom of the screen. If you do not see a T in a cyan color border, then you are not in the US exam mode. If you see a different letter, and a different color for the border, you may be in a different exam mode. When in US exam mode, the auto power off will automatically be set to 60 minutes, which means if you do not touch a button in the last 60 minutes, the calculator will automatically power off. To see the elapsed time since you have been in exam mode, press the red alpha button, then the negative sign button. Then the screen will appear briefly, about three seconds, showing the elapsed time. You can restart the elapsed time by pressing the restart button on the back of the calculator or by re-entering US exam mode. While in US exam mode, if you try to enter one of the calculator modes that are restricted for the exam, you will get this pop-up message. Examination mode, press exit. Press the exit button to make this message disappear. How do I exit exam mode on the Casio FX CG50? There are three ways to exit exam mode on the Casio 
FXCG50. The first way is to turn off the calculator, then wait 12 hours after you have entered the exam mode. Then, after the 12 hours have elapsed, turn the calculator back on. The calculator will then automatically exit exam mode. The second way is to connect the calculator to a computer with the included USB slash mini USB cable. One end of the cable is a USB to connect to the computer. The other end of the cable is a mini USB to connect to the calculator. After you have connected the calculator to the computer, this window appears on the calculator. Choose USB flash. Press F1. Press the F1 button. Now my computer shows the calculator as a USB F drive. Your computer may show a different letter drive. Then, on the computer, enter the drive that is the calculator. In my case, the USB F drive. Now, either copy a file into this drive or delete a file from this drive. I recommend copying a file into this drive. I made a small blank JPEG image file to copy into that calculator USB F drive. After you copy a file into that calculator drive, eject that USB calculator drive. Right click the USB calculator drive. My computer says Expulsar because my computer is set to Spanish language. But on your computer, look for eject. When I press eject, my computer gives me this error message that is OK. Your computer may or may not give you an error message. Then this window pops up on the calculator. Exit examination mode. Restart and restore memories. Press exit. So press the exit button. If you do not press the exit button before five seconds, your calculator may automatically exit exam mode like mine does. The calculator goes back to the main menu or may go back to the last screen you had before you entered the exam mode. Then you will see the color border is gone. So now you are out of exam mode. The third way to exit exam mode is to connect your calculator with another calculator that is not in exam mode. Connect the calculators with the included cable for connecting calculators. It is a little complicated with the steps, and I do not have a second calculator to show you the steps, but you can download this software user's guide from Casio if you want to exit exam mode this way. Okay, that is it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up.